Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm currently away from the Western Cape on a little bit of a holiday. It is Easter weekend and my wife and my family and I are doing a little bit of camping out here in the mountains. I managed to convince her to take at least one of my guns from my home and do a little bit of hunting for you guys this weekend. I've chose this awesome 22 long rifle of mine, the CZ. Uh, I've got a couple of places out here where I can do a little bit of dusty hunting for you guys. And then if uh, the time allows it and I go back to the Western Cape, I'll do a little bit of bird shooting for you guys as well with this gun. So without further ado, let's go out there and let's get started. Perfect shot. Beautiful shot. Smoke that one. Try to hide from me. Perfect shot. So let's speak about my gun setup quickly. This is my 22 LR. It is a CZ 457. Uh, I dropped it into this beautiful Bravo 22 chassis from the guys from AIM Engineering. From the top, I've got an Element Nexus scope. This is the APR 2D reticle, which is a dirty reticle. Wave silencer, which is ridiculous quiet. Akatech bipod using the uh, SideShot GoPro camera system today to record all my footage with. I'm shooting my SK Standard Plus. Another thing that I brought along with me today is the new Element Optics Titan rangefinder, which is a perfect companion to use in a hunting situation like today because I've got all my ballistic data uh, uploaded on the rangefinder. So it's basically just point, get the range, and it shows me exactly what my dope is, what I need to dial to make these shots. That's my gun setup for today. Perfect shot. Straight out. Smoked that one. Smoked it. As I'm loading this mag now, I want to give you guys a quick update. For those who have been following me on social media, would have seen I've posted two brand new pictures of two brand new chassis systems that I helped to co-design a few months back. Two of my good friends from South Africa that has been shooting with me in the firearm industry for years now approached me with an offer and they asked me to help uh, co-design these two chassis. I'm very excited about these two chassis because one is for the FX Panthera and the other one is obviously for my Centerfire, my 6.5 Creedmoor. You guys will be able to see these two gun setups exclusively on this channel for the first time. So you guys need to make sure that you stay tuned to the channel because they're going to be dropped very soon and it's something very awesome. I'll say. Beautiful shot. Perfect shot. 
Another one down. Super easy shot. Well guys, that was a great morning. I managed to knock down a couple of dices here in this mountain range, but I feel I can still give you guys a little bit more footage. So I think I'm gonna take this gun and when I get back to the Western Cape, let's do a little bit of bird hunting down there as well. So without further ado, let's go there. And just like that, I'm back in my province. Still got my 22 LR here with me and I've got a farm full of pace birds. Let's get busy. Lovely, straight down. <laughs> Another one down, perfect shot. <laughs> Come on, drop now, there we go, <laughs> another one down. What's up with the hanging today? All of them are hanging. That one is still hanging over there. Oh. So of course there is some pros and cons shooting a 22 LR versus a air rifle. I've spoken about this many times before and one of the biggest things of course is ammo. Ammo is much more expensive than your air gun projectiles which you're going to buy um, and especially in our country and SA the ammo for 22 LR is very expensive. Um, on the upside there is some good pros on the 22 LR and one of them is that it's super super light and you don't need to carry around a lot of air. Of course it's not an air gun it's a long rifle, so you don't need air. So that's one of the biggest pluses. I can take some ammo, put it in my pocket, and just walk around and don't worry about an air tank. So yeah, always pros and always cons. <laughs> just too easy, easy, easy. <laughs> That's definitely a headshot. I can hear that thump straight down. Oh, what a beauty. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. Just a lot of satisfaction. Another one down, 92 meters. Well guys, that's it for this week's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed today's content. If you did, do me a favor, go smash that like button for me. And for all the new guys, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, and you wanna see more of this kind of content, then you need to subscribe. Again, thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.